Good morning, Steve and Joyce. Yes, the Downtown Seattle Association released that hype video you just saw back in February to just give you an idea of how the new waterfront could look. But if you're like me, you kind of just like to see things for yourself. So we'll start with the waterfront here. You see with the Alaskan Way Viaduct, you know that that'll be gone soon, only to be replaced by what Heidi Hughes of the Friends of Waterfront Seattle says is an open canvas, a space that will invite music, recreation, festivals, and a place where people can come and enjoy all that Seattle has to offer. The other big piece for the waterfront is the construction of the Overlook Walk. Now that's actually going to start at Pike Place Market and give people a way to walk all the way down to the waterfront. In fact, the photos that you're seeing here give you an idea of what they're talking about. You'll notice that it has a bridge over the rebuilt Alaskan Way, so you don't even have to worry about traffic as you make your way down. You'll have areas to sit and just enjoy the views. The Friends of Waterfront Seattle group also says that they're helping to raise $100 million to help pay for some of those changes. Now, if you are like me and you just that still isn't enough for you, there's an app for that, literally. They literally have an app for it, and we'll go ahead and take it full so you can get a see for yourself on what it looks like that will show you a virtual reality 360 design of what the waterfront is going to look like. You'll see that there's a promenade there. There's also a lot of open space that promotes open pedestrian friendly space that you'll be able to see there and uh, also allowing for more people to walk through. Then there's also a showroom that is open to the public from Wednesdays through Sundays. We will have a link to that uh, address and also to the website where you can download this app yourself. You just search for Friends of Waterfront Seattle on the App Store or on the Google Play Store and you can get your hands on it and see for yourself. Now throughout the morning, we'll be kind of bouncing around some of the other locations. We'll be at the aquarium and some other locations that they have planned for to show you what some of those changes are. But for now, reporting live up on the roof, Tony Black, Krim, uh, King Five Mornings. <laughs> oh, man. Well, you know, Krem's our sister station, too, so it's all in the family.